So a lot of fog out there this morning. That should dissipate by mid-morning and definitely gone by midday, but we will still have a lake breeze in effect, keeping us cooler along the north and south shore, and then much warmer once you get further south near Spooner and Siren and Pine City, and then fairly nice out there once you get to Grand Rapids and McGregor. So kind of a decent spread of temperatures today. Not so much the case tomorrow as you get up to the lower 80s for many of the regions, probably upper 70s once you get towards Ashland, then a little bit cooler in Ironwood and Watersmeet because of that northwest breeze that we'll have tomorrow. And then Friday will be cooler for much of us because of a cold front that pushes through, talking mid to upper 70s for some of us, and then a little bit of a lake breeze as well. So looking at how everything plays out the next few days, we've got this low pressure system, a weak one at that, pushing to our south and east. That's going to give us the clouds tonight and into tomorrow morning, a spot shower possible also tomorrow morning. Then that pushes off. We get a clear day tomorrow throughout the afternoon. And then a cold front to our north is going to really draw in some cooler air as well as the potential for some thunderstorms, which have a marginal risk for being severe across the Northland. So that's a one out of five from the Storm Prediction Center. Main threats are large hail up to one inch in diameter and strong winds up to 60 miles per hour. So going through the hour by hour forecast, you can see those clouds still lingering on the north and south shore on this afternoon. And then on Thursday, we get that nice clearing by the afternoon. Northwest breeze shouldn't be a lake freeze. Should be a really nice day tomorrow. And then on Friday morning, you can see those storms begin to pop up to the northwest near I Falls. Those push on through the morning hours. And then we have some scattered storms in the afternoon and evening time. So looking across the region today and tonight can be really warm once you get further south. And then once you're along the lake, you're barely reaching 70 for many of us. And then actually it could be nice out towards Grand Rapids and Hibbing. And most of this fog is going to be gone in the morning. So that's why they're showing that icon right now. And it should be some sun too once you get further west. Then same story along the south shore, cooler and then warm and more sun once you get further south. Spooner, Siren, Hayward, I could see them reaching the upper 80s today. And then tonight, a mild one again, mid 50s to even some low 60s in spots. And then similar story, except a little bit cooler, mid to upper 50s on the Minnesota side of things. So take a look at that seven day. We get that chance of a spot shower tomorrow. And then Friday is when we have that chance of thunderstorms. And then a lake freeze on Saturday keeps us cool, but we should still be mostly sunny. And then on Sunday, Monday, and Tuesday, looking at some clouds and a chance of rain Monday morning, but not too much of a soaker. Should be mainly showers. Back to you guys.